Daily vlog number 84. Guess what I almost forgot to do today. <laughs> it's about 10.30 at night, so as promised, a little late night vlog gets a little late night boogie. That's enough of that. I was reading something from Henry Nouwen this morning, a Christian theologian, mystic, an all-around very interesting guy. And I came to the realization that I don't know who I am. I don't mean that in a Jason Bourne kind of way, although a safe deposit box full of money would be great. But in the sense that I don't know who I am fully, because I don't know me as others experience me. It was kind of a deep thought this morning, so let me see if I can unpack it a little bit. We can get so consumed with ourselves, thinking about our shortcomings, our struggles, but thinking about all the things we do well, or at least we think we do well. And we can form this self-image that is built on only our own input. But the truth is, we encounter people all the time who see things in us that we don't always see. I have never experienced myself as a friend, as a husband, as a son. I know what I do as a friend and a husband and did as a son, but I never experienced it on my own. And that means that those who experience me as a friend, as their pastor, and my wife who experiences me as her husband, they know me differently than I know myself. And I think it's a safe bet that you don't fully know who you are either. And I think that's a good thing. I think we were designed not to know who we are fully. That we need other people in order for us to flesh out our identity. That maybe the thing is, is that we can only be who we truly are in community. This is why I think it's a good idea for us to be telling other people what we think about them, what we admire about them. Because you never know. Someone may be struggling with a bit of who they are that they don't like, never realizing that there is a part of them that is fantastic, that makes you love them. And I'll wager there's some things about you that would encourage you to know other people admire and love. So rather than ask you a question, in the comments below, I'd like for you to write something you admire about someone else. I'm not fishing for compliments here. I don't want these comments to be about me. I just want you to celebrate an aspect of someone you care about and then point them to this video so they could see what you said. Well, this has been daily vlog number 84. 281 to go. I'll talk to you tomorrow.